1994 saw some awesome special effects on screen. But Leonard Maltin tells... The baby's on the roof! Baby Bink sails through a... plays with a gorilla. And now, only 35 designers and operators blend radio control. You know, I got, we meant to see from the, you know, from the, from the back like this. You know, so, so the baby was meant for, this baby was made for scenes like this where, uh, so you can attack the puppeteers as well here. See? <laughs> the Baker Workshop manufactured a total of 13 mechanical babies to stand in for twins Jacob and Adam Wharton. Whenever the action got risky... And it's, uh, or it comes back in. <laughs> Convince it was real. Yeah. You see this part, it kind of gives it away, you know. But uh -huh. again, it was always, only meant to be seen like this. Grab something or do something. We have these little hands like this. And touching your face and touching your glasses. I'm going to grab your glasses here. These scenes feature the actual twins. In this scene, the baby is real. The gorilla. shot where we saw way inside his mouth, way back there. <laughs> in there. There. And you can see we had his little usual moving inside. I close him out of the <laughs> <laughs> goodness gracious, how could I forget? Now, here's a little test. Can you spot Rick Baker's handiwork? Give up? Here are the answers. Real baby, mechanical baby. Real, mechanical. Real, mechanical. And all part of... Hollywood's magic. Leonard Malton, Entertainment Tonight. Thanks a lot, Leonard. Well, Rick Baker is currently working on top secret effects for Batman Forever, and then after that, he will help transform Eddie Murphy from an overweight science teacher to a svelte playboy in the remake of The Nutty Professor. Baby's Day Out is now out on home video.